Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Today I'm gonna show you just a small update <coughs> on the setup of Rear. This is the same setup as the previous video. In the previous video it was a flux gate generator. Here and here are the same, but as you can see, I've put now a 12 pole rotor on the system using the same coils I had uh, a few videos ago in my second uh, pulse motor build of set and uh, entry it is already running because as always the system takes a lot of time for it to get up to speed the input is a uh, 29 volts at say yeah 50 milliamps still kind of the same as you can see I have a pretty large gap in here the reason for that is very simple, the closer I get it to the rotor, the far more output I get, but of course the more lens effect I get also. So I can slide it, um, slide it uh, to the uh, forward or backward, just to get a, a good spot where I still have some energy production and, um, and uh, if it affects the drive side it doesn't affect it that much and this is about here this distance in this setup gonna load it down with four of the LED light bulbs in parallel at the back side of this is nothing special as you can see a bunch of spaghetti wires being held up in place with some rubber bands once more the input yeah let's say 50 milliamps and 29 to 29 and a half volt as always there you can see it spinning at least i hope you can see it spinning anyway gonna load it down now i don't have my uh, rpm meter now because the battery is empty need to buy another one but i can tell you it is slowing down there's still uh, plenty of uh, lens effect in there, which is always a good thing. You cannot have energy production without the lens effect. Let me show you guys in the dark. There's the light production in the dark. Yeah, you can see over there my larger pulse modem. So the output isn't that bad. It is still slowing down. I don't know if you can hear, but I can. And the input is now, yeah, just a little bit less voltage wise, but still pretty much 29 volts. And the milliamps is almost at 100 milliamps. I think it's still slowing down a little bit. The drive side hasn't changed. Uh, I'm not gonna change it because I like it. When you have something good, don't change it. Okie dokie. Nothing special of course. Just playing around a little bit. Getting to know this stuff better. I can switch it off now remove the wires from here as you can see disconnected this 30 volt is in the capacitor over there it will keep spinning for quite a while okie dokie hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching